Hey everyone, it's great to be back with you after being in Texas this past weekend. I had the opportunity to perform a wedding and spend a couple of days with my mom and dad, which I don't get to do very often, so thank you for allowing me to do that. But also I want to thank Gabe for filling in for me. Uh, I heard it was a great day as he shared his heart and shared God's truth with you. But I look forward to being back with you this coming Sunday as we continue to study the names of God. This week I'm going to kind of turn and go into the New Testament and we'll look at some of those names. I'm very excited to share God's Word with you. I also want to share a couple of dates that are coming up. On April the 14th, Friday evening, we're going to have our Good Friday service. That will start at 5.30 and will end about 6.30. Child care will be available, so we want to make sure you can come as a family and have a wonderful experience that evening. But then, of course, two days later will be Easter Sunday, and on April the 16th, we want to encourage you to come and join us as we worship the Lord. It's the Lord's Day. It's the day of all days for Christians. But I also want you to prayerfully consider asking someone to come join you and worship with us that Sunday. Uh, we, we know that there are many people in our area who don't know Christ. Family, friends, co-workers, students that you know. And it, what a great day to invite them to come and hear the greatest thing that's ever happened on the universe, uh, in the universe, on this planet, is that's when Christ was raised from the dead. And what that means, the implications of that. And so I want you to prayerfully consider doing that uh, as I'm doing, and uh, hopefully we'll have some guests with me. So I look forward to seeing you then especially this coming Sunday. God bless you.